Well, okay, I was completely unprepared for that, how that turned out. <laughs> Let's hope this goes a little bit better. Oh, and it might go better if I actually remembered to do the stuff in the menu. That would be nice to do. So, Gold Helm for you, even though it's only 5 magic defense and it only defends against uh, an element pretty much nothing here uses. Uh, more importantly, I'll switch her over to Siren so that she can learn useful spells instead of Demi. Woohoohoo! I. That might be useful for some things, but it's probably not going to be absolutely necessary in the near future, at least. I. Uh, he can stay with Golem. Gao doesn't have much choices. Lock. I'm going to need that life spell considering I only have one Phoenix down. He's only one battle away from getting it, so. Yeah, let's hold off until then. Uh, one last thing, the ice brand on her might as well. One dried meat for you, two for you, and two for you, and now I'm ready to go. Hopefully for better results than last time. Alright, well, I'm not going to make the same mistake as last time again. I love how I just kind of assumed it was Locke there, and it worked out because of his high speed. Um, this is Gao. They almost always go in the same order. Uh... Brawler Rage down here. And drill to the face. You might as well runic. Because uh, I might get some extra cure spells from it and you're not doing anything else. Good work, Edgar. Extreme drilling skills. Now, if that was a general, you might actually take some damage from that. If that was just a flan, it's not going to help. I'm going to have Celeste do stuff just to get her out of the way, really. The only way I'm telling who my characters are here is by, uh just having him alternate because Gal's out of the way on his own. Alright, I think that probably... Nope. Is that it? Alright, I've taken one step back up. Listen. Where go, stuff is happening. Alright. One, two, three. There, I avoided making the more mundane mistake I made the time before. Alright. So the handy thing is, there's this piece of machinery here that I can run into. If I take one step down from the chest, at least. One. Two, three, four. Alright, so now I should be up the staircase. Now I should be up towards the top there. This part isn't as long as the first part, so... If I fail here, it's not so bad. There's a battle. Oh, now that I think about it. Okay, this is Gao. Switch you over to the Bio Blaster now. And. Uh, okay, you are a guard. Log, you're slow on the ball today.
Alright, no. Celeste should be casting Bolt for maximum effectiveness. Uh, well, she's apparently casting Remedy for minimum effectiveness, but <laughs> the minor details. I think my magic menu shuffled its order since I last looked at it closely. Um. Oh yeah, switching skills and everything. That's a uh, save. That's the first order of business, healing. Now that sends my cursor onto lock. So skills. Lock. Um. Oh yeah, I was already on Espers because I was messing around in there earlier. And Rama should be first thing. Okay. There's the door I was looking for. There's the chest I was looking for. There's the elevator I was looking for. These are proto men, they're definitely not the droids I'm looking for. Um, mache. Don't mache because I don't want to use remedy again. Bolt, there we go. That's useful. Now that I think about it, she may even have learned Remedy just naturally. What is that? I'm kind of scared by whatever that was. Well, one of those got deflected, which means that there's a general, which means that I might as well not even do anything to block, because they're about to get gassed. Why, why was the... oh wait, maybe that's a strike. I always mistake that for a claw. I was looking over the Imperial Camp segment recently because I was just uploading that, so... I'm probably making the same mistake here. Yeah, good thing Locke wasn't in the front row. He would have been dead as a doorknob. There's my elevator. Which means I'm pretty much at the top. Run into the bear belt. I don't mind that. And now I can go across here. If there's a battle on the other side, it'll tell me when I'm across. Otherwise, it's... I'm going to have to put a bit of safety on this. Just because I don't know where the crane was when I pressed right. Alright, so I think I'm probably at the end. Up, left, down, and onto the conveyor belt. Thankfully, going through here, uh, I, I'm just going straight down to the bottom, no detours anymore. So it's not too long. Alright, so Sless. Well, everybody's just doing okay stuff just by uh, pressing A there. Gao clearly didn't die because he wouldn't have used the plasma, obviously, if he, if he was dead. I'm not sure how that would work. Oh, yeah, run, coward.
Alright. All the way right. No chest to tell me where I am this time, but down to the box. Left. And onto the conveyor belt. Just a couple steps to get on the next conveyor belt. So yeah, it was nice to be able to put a break in there. And not even have to go out of my way much for it. belt and made it. Stay away from the eye for it. <laughs> that would be a very bad move. There we go. On to the safe point. Made it. So, level 14s and 16. I guess it's not overly overleveled by this point. I think I'm about par for the course. See you next time. One, two, three. I know what happened. Well, I can go back to my old strat, I guess. Okay. I don't know what's going on. Whatever, I'll just restart. I don't know if I did something bad when I did something earlier. Okay, then. Out the door. Now, I'm running into... Ooh. Uh, never mind. I'm not running into anything right now. And he's my, and I only have one phoenix down, so. Oh crud! No, I was sitting right next to Ifrit. Uh, <laughs> I shouldn't have been mashing through that. Um. Okay. Let's try to beat Ifrit. I don't know. So if this is lock, which it might be. Oh yeah, you have no magic if you're lock. So let's try to try to meet on somebody. So I'm going to assume that you're Gao. In which case, what rage do I want, and can, do I even have a hope of finding it? Um, should I just stick with Brawler? It's okay, it's not elemental. Let's just stick with Brawler. I'm just assuming based on their speeds, who's going to be coming up where. And you, Runic. Drill their faces off, Edgar. Oh no, Fireball, that is not good, that is not good at all. Um... I'll have him heal. My guy will be healing on his own, and he's the only one who's not taking seizure damage. I'll have Locke heal Celeste. I think that's Celeste. Locke isn't even healed on MP like he's supposed to be. This is Celeste. My only source of multi-target healing. So she might as well do that. Alright, so let's have Locke heal himself. I don't know. It doesn't seem like a bad choice. Gal might be dead considering his whole, uh, not moving recently. Okay, never mind. There's his moving. What am I doing? Oh, I just had luck to heal, I think. Yeah, whoops. I should send some of that Edgar's way anyway. Then again, I sent some of that Edgar's way, so he's probably not doing too badly. If I had Kieran to, to make up for that fireball. Ow, that's gonna be bad. Whoever got hit by that fire too, they're not dead yet. Unless it's Edgar, I suppose. If I actually win this, <laughs> that would just be random and hilarious, I guess. Shivan should be out now. Not that I have any clue what that means anyway. Ow, my face. Maybe I should get Celeste on Runic Duty again. Uh, I don't believe I did the right thing. Um, 
I don't know what's- I think Locke may have died. Uh, I think I had Celeste Waster turn pretty much just- Oh, there's Locke. Uh, Locke, where'd you go? This is bad. I'm pretty sure I only heard three that time. Oh gosh. So that's probably the only person alive now. What's Celeste gonna do on her own? Ha! <laughs> Take that! I beat you! <laughs> no, I'm not gonna win the cheating way. <laughs> yeah, let's try this again.